The Scarab Lives is really fun and a really great introduction to Scooby-Doo and Scrappy-Doo. This is, of course, the first episode of the first season, and I'm actually currently watching Scooby-Doo Where Are You? And I thought I'd check out some of the other series to see what jogs my memory, as I can't distinguish exactly certain memories of Scooby-Doo that I have between different series. And I have to say, seeing Scrappy-Doo again for the first time in maybe decades, was rather delightful. And this story is so fun. The gang are a fan of this um, comic book superhero called the Scarab. But it turns out that the Scarab character has actually come to life and he's become a villain. And they meet the the the, the artist, the illustrator, and they try and track down what is going on. I love that idea. I love the idea of illustrations coming to life and it does a pretty great job. I really like the design of the scarab. I think he's got a really great style and he leaves a calling card of a painting of a scarab which also looks awesome. There's a lot of blue in this. It's a very satisfying colour palette and I didn't work out what was going on and I like that and I think that when it was revealed things made sense. Sometimes with Scooby-Doo reveals can feel a little bit forced like I don't necessarily agree with the character who was responsible for whatever. But with this one I was very happy with the narrative as a whole, very well animated, great pacing, adorable introduction to Scrappy-Doo, uh, at least introduction in this TV show. I, I rather enjoyed the character and have very fond memories. I don't remember this episode specifically. It didn't bring any memories back but I still really thoroughly enjoyed it. I'm probably going to check out the first episodes of various Scooby-Doo series and then decide which series I want to make the most effort to watch. But for now, I really enjoyed this first episode and I'm definitely curious to see what the rest of the series has in store.